today I've got a really cool video. I just want to create this intro to clarify a couple things that uh, got left out and out of context in this video. Uh, I got a new camera and I filmed a whole first day to this video and it had no audio. So I got the audio settings figured out. At the end of the video, I mentioned that I had showed a process for my rock tumbling, but I never actually showed that. So I started tumbling the rocks that we find on our rock hounding adventures. But yeah, this little intro is just to clarify that. Check out these uh, awesome rocks that we found and let's get into the video. Hello and welcome to another day of rock hounding. Today we are actually in a proper spot. We are in the Nehalem River and uh, it sounds like we already found some. Hey. Oh, he's pissed. He's gonna fight the camera. He's protecting the gemstones. Oh my god, he's pissed. Look, George, he's coming at me. He's protecting the gemstones. So we should actually be able to find some really cool stones here. Some agates, some jaspers. He's literally coming out of the water to attack me. So uh, we just got down here and uh, yeah, let's see if we can find anything cool. The river seems not too deep, so be able to find anything cool on the riverbed or in the water. Two seconds later. I could not be more excited for my first ever real rock hunting find. This is my first rock. I wasn't even reaching for this one. I was reaching for a different one. I looked next to it and this is what I find. Wow. That is literally the coolest first find. That makes me excited for this spot. I found it right under this tree. I, uh, a lot of people say look around bends and like near trees because there's a lot of dropout because of the density of crystals and stones like this. So gonna keep looking, but holy shit, is that exciting for a first find. It is quite beautiful out here. And there's no one else out here, it's just Lovely little creek, but we're getting skunked ever since finding the first one. So I think we're gonna go up river a bit and uh, see if we can't have any luck that way. All right, later buddy, you win. So a different uh, location, about 30 minutes away from where we were. Same river though, just hopefully a better location. It's uh, just as gorgeous here. He likes the uh, environment. So, walking down to the river right now. Hopefully, we'll find something cool here. It smells like dirt, she says. Oh, I already see some rocks. I don't know if they're good ones, though. Wow. A big old chunk of it. Literally, right I think, away. I think kicking at a rock. Wow. Looks nice. I think so. It's a big ass piece, too. Nice, George. Oh wow, yeah. I just found this one. I saw like the tiniest glimpse of white in this little cesspool and I... Raven keeps finding better stuff than me. It's pissing me off. It's beautiful. It is beautiful. We're at a, at a river and up in these tree roots right here, I just found like an ocean shell. Maybe like a river otter. Brought this all the way from the ocean? No, maybe there's those kind of things here. Or put it on their Maybe it's like a oyster shell. Well, I found it up in these roots. Oh my god, there's a snail shell. You want this trip? So I walked out on this little outcropping and I was kind of bummed. Wasn't really finding anything. And then I just did a random grab into the water and I found this. Don't exactly know what it is. But it's translucent. I need a geology book to tell me what all this stuff is. But this one's really pretty. This was literally just like a random grab into the water. So that's always fun. I keep finding these rocks that have crystal growths on them. Yeah, I wonder if there is more. The other one had a cavern that had crystals in it, like a geode. That's cool. Yeah. I found this, which I think is Jasper. Beautiful piece. So I got this, this huge crystal. Oh, that's cool. It's massive. Maybe it's citrine. I don't know what it is, but it's huge. It's cool. Excited to get home and clean this one up. Oh, so that's uh, Jasper again. Another crystal. Some really pretty ones. Very pretty. 
Not bad. Not bad first actual day on an actual river for rock handling. Mm -hmm. So let's get home. We got a bag full of <laughs> rocks. It's pretty heavy. Uh, let's get home and tumble these things, clean them up. Raven just found something cool, supposedly. I can't stop looking. I thought it was Jasper in the water. Uh-huh. And I flipped it. <gasps> it's a beautiful geode. Wow. Whoa. Ho -ho. Nice. Oh, wow. That's pretty. I keep just going to wash my hands and seeing more. There's a crawdad, so I'll respect this space and I'll get out of here. I'm not going to take it home because it's just crystals growing on a rock, but it's still cool. I think we should keep it. We'll get these home, we'll get them all cleaned up, and uh, I'll film what all we found, because we didn't obviously film every single one we found, so. All right, so we made it home. We got some rocks to tumble in there. Those should be done next week. So all the rocks that we collected today, they're not gonna be tumbled till next week. So uh, let's just go ahead and see what we got going on in here. We got some pretty nice specimens. I think this is Jasper. Ooh, here's the good stuff. That's the big one you found? Yeah, this is uh, one of the big ones I found. Ooh, this one's really cool. So this is everything, well, besides this one, that we collected today at the river. And they don't look too crazy, uh, not wet. You know, they look kind of normal, but a lot of these are crystals and other stuff so these will look really cool tumbled some of these bigger pieces of jasper we might hammer down and try to tumble them into smaller pieces but yeah no this is everything it was a really good day huh mm -hmm. good hey. call 24 hours later all right started let's drain these little bad boys okay so this is the one did we show washing this oh these are the ones we collected at the Willamette. Number one stage, they've been in there for a week now. Oh, oh god. Oh no. I feel like it's less thick than the fish. Ooh, they're all down. They weren't playing around before. Wow. These are really awesome. So these are the ones we found over on the Willamette. And... Whoa, some of them got some crazy sparkle in them. And they're very gray in a lot of them. Wow, good stuff. So I'm not gonna show putting these back in for round two, so I've already showed that, but yeah, this is round one of rock tumbling. For all the rocks we found on the Willamette River. So it's very, very cool. I'm happy with what we found. I'm happy with what we found. Okay, this is the one I'm really curious about. This one's been going for three weeks. It's went through the coarse, medium, and fine steps, so the last step is just the polished step. Hopefully they didn't lose any size. They sound small. Really? I don't know, I can't tell. I'm really excited to pour this out. Before, oh my gosh. I feel like some of them were tiny when we put them in. Some of them were so small. Damn, that's sad. Wow, they look so good though. Wow, is that bloodstone? This is the one that is my favorite, and I feel like it even has gotten smaller since last time I saw it. Well, it shouldn't get smaller in this last step. <laughs> this one's one of my faves, and it got really small, which is sad. I mean, it's still nice. Yeah. Maybe it's because I'm so used to seeing the other ones now, the bigger ones. Yeah. Cool. Well, let's put these in for the polish. I'm excited to see it in a week. This has been three Goes to hit. Oh, and he gets it. What the? With the nice. 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 With the nice.